Okay, so about two weeks ago or so, uh, just cooked the damn food. Those guys over there did an amazing video. It was one, it was called Toad in a Hole. And I commented on their video, something along the lines of that was something I would do or something like that, I don't remember. And they said, I'd like to see your version. And I got to thinking about it. I'm gonna do one, I wanna do one, so I'm just gonna show it to you. And be sure and check them guys out too. It's awesome, they're an awesome channel. Subscribe, support, just cook the damn food. So what I'm gonna do, and I have this side on, this side off, is we're gonna make first the donut. Uh, then you put the egg inside. This is some ground beef, 80-20. And I've got, uh, actually, that's sausage, and this is the ground beef. So I'm going to mix the two. First, let me just set these over here. Get some uh, gloves on. It's also a nice day out here. It's about 50 degrees. Don't see any flies. It's perfect. For cooking a toad in a hole. Okay, so I'm just going to go ahead and take take a good part of the hamburger meat. Not no measurements here, but a good part of sausage, almost equal, not quite. And I'm just going to mix it, kind of mash it together. I just like uh, hamburger meat and sausage mixed up do that often. Let's see if we got this patty. I think it's maybe big enough. I don't know what it weighs. It's gonna... Yeah, I've never really heard of this until I saw this on their channel. And it just looks good. Going to try it. All right, got that mixed up. I'm just gonna press that down. Now, going to get that. What I want to do. So kind of, I was looking through our cookie cutters and I found this. And I thought, you know, we're going to see if this will make a hole in the middle. It's not very round, is it? I know I'm not going to do as good as those guys did. This thing might just fall plumb apart. Let's see. We're going to put that in there. And the hole thought is <laughs> I'll pull this out from around it oh no or get under it yeah not quite right I need to spin it okay there we go got something going on there now I've somehow got to transfer this. Let me try to get that. We're going to take this, lay it on the hot side right here. Here we go. <laughs> then I'm going to go ahead and add some of this. Um, I don't know, I got these uh, Omaha steaks. Uh, the neighbor actually gave me some. Uh, I'll make a video when I do the steaks, uh, and it came with some of the seasoning, so I think I'll just try that on here. Put that on here and put this back in this patty. I put a little extra on that. I say, I don't know, I've read, put about 40% more, 40-50% more of the seasoning uh, than what you typically want when you eat because when you're grilling, you know, you're going to lose part of it anyway flipping it around and I cut this cool little cat and I got this for, for uh, My father's day uh, gift kids got this for me in June of this year I don't think I ever showed it on here. It's pretty cool Portable put your paper towel. You can put everything you're going to need for the cook bring it out Hang your spatula measuring whatever you need so got that out here today using that. We're going to go ahead and let this go ahead and cook for just a little bit. Then we're going to flip it, pop the egg right in the bottom of it or right in the middle of it, add some cheese to it, throw it on a bun. Hope, hopefully the flip works well. I've, I got this, which is uh, 
pretty good size. So let's we'll see how this goes. Uh, also, if you watch this channel every night and flip things around just a little bit, uh, so got the camera facing the yard instead of the house. I think it's a better view. It's a better view than just looking at the stale house. Plus, if it rains, the camera's there. If it were to snow, the camera's there. Eh, you'll be able to witness everything. No weather expected today, though. We're just going to let this cook for a bit and then flip it. I won't bore you too much, so I'll bring you back when I do flip it. Okay, so let's go ahead and try and flip this. Uh, see how it does here. Make sure all sides are good and loosened up. Yep. All right. There it is. Got a nice caramelization on that side, don't it? Gonna add some of this uh, Mile High Guy Barbecue Sweet sauce a little bit on here. Good stuff right there. Put that around there. Take an egg. Right there. Get some of this seasoning, put all on that. And I want to close that in so that egg cooks real good. And I'm going to use some grated cheese. We're going to seal the top up. Real good. Let that egg cook inside there. Temperature will come up. It's going to be good. I'm going to turn the heat down just a little bit because we want this to kind of cook for a bit get everything cooked good and done melted and all that as a matter of fact I actually have a dome somewhere but I don't know where I'm gonna put this pan over the top let that kind of heat come in there we're just gonna let that cook for a little bit and then I'll take it off throw it on a bun and we're gonna get it give it a try so I really don't know what the proper way is um, this is just a version there's not i'm not going by any recipe i'm putting it together as i go and um, just the way i like it the way i think i would like it and that's what i'm doing here make it your way give it a try put your own touch to it it's what cooking's all about ain't it i'm just going to put a little bit of that on here i did check the burgers i think they're pretty much done everything's above 160 degrees all the way through egg included put that on and then just throw that on here we'll take a look at it oh, don't that just look amazing Woo! go ahead and keep that covered just another little bit while we get this bread cooked here Nah, that needs to cook a little more. Push that on down and ain't getting to it. That looks nice right there. That one's looking good too. We'll take that right there. Go ahead and remove this cover. And we're going to go ahead and take this off. What do you think of that? Mm. Let's get a knife and let's cut into that. Oh boy. Time to separate it. Time to separate it. Let's take a look, folks. Wow. Does that not just look absolutely amazing? 
Look at that. The egg, the layer of cheese, the meat. Got the barbecue sauce. It's only one thing left to do. <laughs> mm. 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 The next time you think you want a burger with an egg, right here, right here. Oh, that's good. I want to thank Just Cook the Damn Food for the great ideal. And this is um, an excellent, excellent, excellent item. I'll be making it again. I'll be making it again. I mean, come on now, take a look at that. 